Hi everyone, thank you for joining me to a new video by Original Video Reviews. Today we have this big package and it's quite a big package and we're going to share together the experience of finding out what's inside. So let's not waste any time, get the Swiss knife, this is the Swiss knife, you're supposed to know it already and with one ninja cut we're going to find out what's inside. This box was inside the package, you can see here that it's written Bobo VR and something in Chinese, I don't read Chinese. The box itself, it's a bit squashed, uh, but I hope that it didn't damage what's inside. Let's reveal what's inside the box. Voila! And we have these VR glasses. As you know, I already did several video reviews of uh, VR glasses. Inside the box it contained the Bobo VR glasses which I'm going to review in several moments. Also you have the instructions in Chinese and in English. This side is in English. You should read it. It will make you much wiser after you will review it. This thing I'm not sure what it is because it's in Chinese. And you also have this cloth in order for you to clean the lenses of the VR glasses. Let's go back and talk about the Bobo VR glasses. I have to say that Bobo is quite a funny name because it reminds me of a German DJ called DJ Bobo from the beginning of the millennium. You can look for his videos on YouTube. The manufacturer of the Bobo VR glasses, his name is Xiao Zai Technologies, I hope I pronounce it correctly. The glasses will fit smartphones between 4 to 6 inches and they weight 190 grams approximately. In order to place the smartphone inside the Bobo VR glasses, you open them like this. It's very easy to open them. You can already see inside my Galaxy S5. This black sponge, it puts pressure on the smartphone and it prevents it from being loose when the cover is closed. This specific part, it's supposed to be removable in order for you to use the smartphone camera for AR content, augmented reality. But I have to say that it's very difficult to remove it. I couldn't manage to remove it even though you're supposed to pull it from here and I tried to press it from the inside. I didn't manage to remove it. And this feature of the augmented reality, the AR feature, it applies for every virtual reality glasses that I reviewed before. But in this specific model, it's very difficult to remove this part. So keep that in mind. You can adjust the lenses of the Bobo VR glasses in two different ways. First, you have those two black switches which you can move from right to left. In addition, you can rotate those lenses so it takes them far or closer to your eye pupils. I have to say that I don't like this feature so much comparing to the other VR glasses that I already reviewed. This material separates between your head and the glasses. I guess that if you're using it for a long period of time, it's supposed to be very convenient. According to the instructions of the Bobo VR glasses, you're not supposed to use them for more than two consecutive hours. From the bottom side of the Bobo VR glasses, you can notice this area which is supposed to fit for your nose. And you can notice those two pivots. I feel that they might break if you put too much pressure and also you can't open it more than this angle. So I'm afraid that this thing in the long run might break. These are the headbands. They are very elastic and they are adjustable with this Velcro adjustment. On the left side of the Bobo VR glasses, you can see that there is a QR code which you can scan and you're supposed to download the Bobo VR glasses software. Also, there is this cut which allows the sound to come out from your smartphone and also if there are cables, you can uh, insert them from here. And there is the same cut on the right side of the Bobo VR glasses. Right now, I would like to discuss about my user experience from wearing the Bobo VR glasses. I tested them with several VR videos. First of all, the headbands. They are adjustable, but they feel cheap and not as easy to adjust as the ones from other VR glasses that I tested before. The second problem, and this is the main problem with the Bobo VR glasses, is adjusting the lenses. Over the top, you can adjust them from side to side. This is okay. This is working fine. But if you want to take the lenses far or closer to your eye pupils, you have to roll those two lenses. And this is a big problem because you have to take the glasses 
on and off all the time and to try to play with the lenses in order to adjust them and I didn't manage while I was watching the video to find the perfect adjustment and it's a big problem so I think that I can't use it this way. Other things that I think you should know about the Bobo VR glasses. There is a specific application for the Bobo VR glasses. I didn't test it yet. I might do that in the future, but if you have an impression about it, I invite you to comment about this video and write to me about that. On the left side, you can find the QR code that will allow you to download the application. And you can also find the QR code in the instructions. Like many other models of VR glasses, you can connect your uh, smartphone to headsets or to a joystick. Uh, I recommend you to use a Bluetooth connection in order to do that. The instructions of the Bobo VR glasses uh, are very easy to read and they recommend you not to use them more than two consecutive hours. I'm not a doctor, but I think that this is very logic. I hope that this video review about the Bobo VR glasses was helpful. I invite you to comment about this video and ask questions. I will try to do my best to answer your questions. If this video review was helpful, I invite you to like this video and you can also subscribe to my YouTube channel, Original Video Reviews. Thank you for watching this video. Bye bye.